Hey everyone, welcome to another Dirty Room Live, our Super Bowl after party special. special. And we are so excited that Montana won tonight, or who won? Montana, that was it. <laughs> Kansas City Chiefs. No, Kansas uh, we never watched, I didn't watch, so I don't know. Uh, it's on the halftime show. <clears throat> the halftime show. The kids. Shakira and, and Jen. I mean, they were great. Anyway, welcome everyone. Uh, we are here. We are live. We are in this room that is awful. Just first impressions. It, Housekeeping doesn't care. Owners don't care. It fucking reeks. It smells. They, they cover it up with some kind of cover-up scent. No, it, it's, it, it, it's yeah. suffocating. Yeah, I mean, yeah, yeah, yeah no, it, yeah. It is, it's choking. Yeah, it's it's terrible. You walk in from the outside door into the hallway, and it hits you like a slap in the face. I have a feeling that our black light test is going to be abominable, especially on that bathroom door over there. This thin piece of wood. Yeah. We'll have to guess what's the fluid. I love that game. Uh, yeah. It's one of my favorite games. Guess best, the fluid. Best Super Bowl game. Your family, all your extended families left. Uh, before we uh, begin, I'm going to announce this a couple of times during this feed because I really want to get Rick's channel uh, to a point where we can monetize it. But if you guys can go over and follow Rick Sarah on YouTube. And as as I'm saying this, Christopher Aguilar says, Daddy thinks it's hard. Daddy's thing is hard again. Daddy's thing is hard again. Oh, my little princess. I love my little princess. I love my little, princess. Hey, my little princess. Rick introduced me to BDLG. Uh, but please go over. <laughs> I was just little, I was just little princess. I'm, I'm so sorry. <laughs> but I thought you wanted to. When you kept saying no, I thought that meant yes. <laughs> <laughs> Thank you, Cassidy him, Rose. We love you, I too. I gave you $10. I mean, for God's sake. Uh, so Rick has a channel on YouTube. It's called Rick Sarah. You're kidding. You can go over there and subscribe. And there is a really interesting behind-the-scenes documentary that Rick shot and I edited about our time filming Dirty Rooms in Buffalo, New York. So you can kind of see what goes into it and see how tired and miserable we all are and sweaty and... And how drunk and stoned Rick is. And how drunk and stoned Rick is. No, it really didn't show that too much, I don't think. Lainey Baker would like a shout-out. Let's shout-out Lainey Baker. Lainey Baker! Lainey Baker! Um, so, anyway, um, we do have a new soap here tonight. I think I'm going to make Rick eat it. Well, let's not let's 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 talk about when we get to Rick's bathroom check. Wait a minute, finesse. That oh my god, that looks scrumptious. Did you see how they gave us the bags? I, the towel. Oh, pick that up. Okay, this is how you get your your towels through a, through a, a drawer that comes out of the wall. You pull out a bag. Here's your towel. She puts the thing in the in the drawer, and they push it. Fred Street, hello. They push it through. Unbelievable. Well, you got something. You got a useful... Amelia Lawrence a has sent me a message on Instagram, and I have to open it. <clears throat> Username is Alima Faith. But, Amelia, when I get off of here, I will definitely go look. Is it a nudie? <laughs> oh God! I'm so sorry, Amelia. Is that everyone, a I apologize to everyone who's watching and to Amelia. That's called humor. I'm sorry, Amelia. You can't take a joke. I'm just playing. Okay, Gonzi, thank you. We really appreciate it. Okay, let's do the room tour. It's going to take a long time. It is. It's massive in here. <laughs> it's amazing. Um, do, does this have anything printed on here about where we are? No, God. No. It just says normal standard okay. stickers. Okay. Is the door locked? Well, the first thing's first. Let me show you guys this. I love this. Oh, shit. I can't. It's a thing on it. Uh, it says, it says here at the blah, 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 we do not tolerate any forms of prostitution or selling of drugs on our property. 
cameras are here for a reason. Wow. If it's found that someone is selling drugs or prostituting on this property, you will be put off the property and the local authorities will be called. No refunds will be given. Danny moved the camera towards a piece of paper. That had to I better call that guy and tell him not to come. Okay, there's, there's, there's just <laughs> things everywhere. Yeah, I'm sure somebody will figure it out. Anyway, uh, these are our cigarettes. Uh, but... Oh, yeah, weed man. Weed man, yeah, I think that you better not come here after all, okay? I know, I mean, I really was hoping to see you tonight, but uh, there's a sign in the hallway outside of the room where we're going to have our orgy, and it says that uh, they have cameras and shit. I don't want you to get in any trouble, okay? All right, buddy. I'll catch you tomorrow. Bye. How did you become friends with Weed Man? Anyway, uh, that's little Rick's <laughs> gag there. The great superhero. Here's our bed. Um, <clears throat> we saw a little roach on the floor. Yeah, there was a roach crawling on the floor. Look for his house. I'm so excited. Hot Melinda Paranormal. Uh, hold on. <laughs> Lindsay Bromley, thank you. And Hot Melinda Did you Paranormal. Unplug us? Damon. Listen. I think it finally went off. Tori Strawn, thank you, darling, so much. Michelle Repepi, thank you, darling. Love you, too. And Aaron Jaeger Darkness, or Iren Jaeger Darkness. Is it e -R -E Super Chat won't allow shout outs. Boo. I don't. What does that mean? I don't know what that means. Okay, uh, but thank you, anyway, Aaron. Um, oh, look at this fucking floor. The floor is really gross. It's dirty. Everything in here it's is stuffed, awful. It's chipped. It's unswept. Uh, Christopher Aguiar says, is it really ADR if your door doesn't open to a parking lot full of weeds? Well. Is that Christina Aguilar, the singer? Wow. Thank you very much. We have a lot of famous singers who like our show. I'm glad you joined the crowd. Thank you, Christina. Yes, my uh, my daughter loved your stuff, and I bought CDs. Oh, for, for fuck's sake! I can't take it. Uh, these are very uh, streaked. Which... They seem like the newest thing in here. Now we did see a rose crawl up front of the bed, so I'm assuming. How many times you got to say that? I'm assuming we're probably going to see some roaches. Um... You gloving up already? The black gloves here. I just got a bunch of stuff. Oh. I just got a whole bunch of them. Oh, good. Oh, back there. You're good. I came prepared. Sammy Moore, thank you. Hopefully we will find some clitty litter. <laughs> some clitty litter, yeah. The place reeks of it. Why do you use those kind of words in a nice family show like this? <laughs> 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 Yeah. It's a family show. It is. <laughs> oh, my God. Everyone's gathered around uh, the campfire watching. Uh, uh, DNY Wish, uh, happy to finally catch you guys live. Will Rick taste the soap tonight? And that's a yes. So, uh, first of all, look, guys, look at the door. Look. Look at the door. I want to find out what that is. I want to find out how dirty it is. I don't know what that is. And then this, here, look. That's fucked. And then... Rapids444 found out that they're allergic to cockroaches. Some people can be very allergic to cockroach manure. Some people can be very allergic to so, anything. It looks like the shower's bleeding. Like I hate when there's pe peanut butter with roach droppings in it. I hate it when my door frames are <laughs> one foot wide. Yeah, what is this? Jesus, this is awful. Literally, this, this is, is like a 24-inch wide. Look door. at the mold and mildew. Now, you guys are looking at this, and you're saying... Oh, it's nice, nice dark ground. No, it's supposed to be white ground. And you see how brown it is? It should be white. You see a few white spots here and there, but... And then there's a nice rust formation on the corner there. Yeah, it's really along bad. Along the edge of this... Because that's not aluminum. That's just a crappy uh, sheet metal steel yeah. kind of stuff. Yeah, yep. 
So it's rusting. Virginia Wolf, we love you too, darling. Thank you so much. Is the window uh, it's totally sealed? Joe shut. Grindle says chunky peanut butter. I don't know what he's referring to, but... um. That's when you have roaches and peanut butter mixed together. It's chunky. Oh, I, oh. thank you, Rick. It's a, it's a... Maybe one day we'll have a cooking show. And I'll, and I'll show you where the roach parts are when I take it out of the peanut butter We can jar. start, we can start. We'll start with Skippy and then we'll go to Jeff and Peter Pan. Peter Pan and we'll show you which one has most pieces. We can start with a dead, or, uh, uh, dirty room salad. We haven't done one of those dirty in a while. Dirty room salad, we haven't done it for a while. Yeah. Wow. That's where you collect everything and put it on a plate. Dan, it, just from your light, I'm seeing so much shit flying in the air. Just look at the space that your light is shining. Oh, yeah. It is unbelievable. Why was that so scary, that sound? Someone's shutting a door harder than they should. Jen and Matt, we love you, too. Thank you so much for tuning in and watching. We love you guys. Did you enjoy the Super Bowl? Did anybody watch the Super Bowl? We're not going to talk. Did anybody give a... Well, See, people like Rick, Bowl. that's all they don't, That's all they have to think about. Okay, he's wearing a, some sort of bird on his no, shirt. No, this is the Ravens t-shirt because the Ravens were close to it at the end, but they got eliminated before the bomb. Let's go ahead and kill the lights. And now we're going to go into Sammy Moore <laughs> cooking with Rick a la roach souffle. I really like that. Oh, it's kinda... I do. Okay, it's black light time. I'm afraid... We're going to start over here by the door. And let's see what we got. And, oh, okay. We got that. Little subtle. Look at all the crud dripping out of the... The lock. The, the lock thing, the yeah. The lever type of handset. The electric, electric card opener. Miss Mia Culpa, I'm so glad you're here. I mean, I'm glad you feel comforted by these videos. Oh, oh, no. oh, no, oh, no, okay. All right, first. We just found something. First down here. Down you see, there. You see this. But we're going to go here to the curtain. We definitely have some. Some wipage. Ew. That, oh, my God. What? That That's from somebody putting their, their cum covered or or. Were they wiping it off? You Philistines don't recognize an original Pollock when you they see one. Probably, <laughs> they probably. They <laughs> probably. That was a delayed reaction from Dan. <laughs> started screaming. He was too too busy trying Wait, to do on. a straight faced uh, review of the. Oh my God! It's over there. This. All the way to the other side. What's that blue shit? Uh, I don't know, but it's not good. Whatever it is. Look up like here. Oh. So yeah, it's just somebody had come on their hands and they um, went to open up the curtain. And they touched the curtain and rubbed it off on the curtain. Oh That's exactly God. what it is. It's transfer of the uh, male fluid onto the curtain to create a... D horizontal DJ Jizzy Trail. <laughs> horizontal Jism Trail yeah. parchment hanging. Lacey's Vlog says the newest shopping with Rick. <laughs> Look at Rick's shirt. Look at Rick's shirt. Oh. What's that? Oh no. Uh, just some clitty litter. The shit's getting on me from the Lacey's air. Vlog said the newest shopping with Rick was great. I even turned the picture of Rick. With the bunnies into a Polaroid. <laughs> Keep oh, up you? Oh. the amazing work, guys. Thank you, you Lacey's Vlogs. You know what you do for that when you save it for Easter time? That'd be a great card. Oh, yeah. It's it, it, adorable. Have Easter with me on there. That'd adorable. Uh, okay. What if this... Yeah, well, that could have come from a drink, I guess. Uh, I'm waiting to... St I, I know. See, I said, where's the handprint? Of course... It's right over. It's right here. Yeah. No, it's just some. No, it's dirty... an imprint over top of it. I see it. People are disgusting. Like they, they got to put their hands. I mean, I hate. Look, I, I, I know that. I wish when you're in a. Uh, how can I call this uh, room? A room for sexual gratification with two partners of whatever orientations. Uh, there's no handles or anything for you to grab 
when you're into yeah. the game, you know? When you're doing if the they, maneuver. I mean, if you're doing the maneuver, if they put a couple short little handicap grab rails on there, you could grab them instead. And that would be really great. Help keep yourself still so you weren't sliding all over the bedspread, so you weren't spreading it all over the damn bedspread at the same time. So please... People who have these kind of F motels, would you please add some handrails around the bed? They do people? have sex motels where you they have stuff like that. Well, they need to upgrade this place. Get modern. We need that. And, Get with for, the and, for, and for people that have some physical handicaps, maybe some side rails and shit, you know. Okay, you can I continue? A, a trapeze, maybe. May I, may I continue? A trapeze. a trapeze with like a, a, sex chair. a chair hanging. <laughs> <laughs> Good old Spencer Nolan Rice sex chair. Oh my God, that's a, what's a brand? <laughs> I want to get the catalog. <laughs> okay, on the other side of the bed now. We've got, um, we know oh, that's what, a good fall, yeah, a solid one there. So we know what that is. That's that, that, that must have been uh, somebody that's on testosterone treatment. That was going to be the see. next president. Yeah, this is a definite. That was going to be the next president. The next president? <laughs> oh, been. my God. It could have been. Don't waste your seat. <laughs> oh, my God. The next president. I love that P one. President Clump. <laughs> <laughs> oh, that's, oh, that's President Clump on the wall there, isn't it? <laughs> okay, let's... Uh, Oh, oh, it like glows. Oh, no. oh, no. It's like almost no. algae. Look what at how green it looks. The fuck. I swear it's algae. Guys, this oh, my green goodness. you're seeing, and we, we saw it in the room tour in the bathroom. This is just pure mildew, mold, whatever you want to call it. Check out the chair. Um, no, what's on the chair? The uh, chair looks fine. Thank goodness I was sitting on that one. Oh, no, not please. No, mine's fine, too. Shh. I was like, <laughs> I don't want to be sitting on this. Man, I wish you had all kinds of yeah. marks. But just, a, just maybe look. even a, a landing strip. <laughs> <laughs> the Corona. <laughs> so disgusting. Uh, Jake. Corona slide. Ricky the hotel man was jolly happy soul with... His purple eye and punched in nose, and his tooth made out of coal. <laughs> oh, <my God. laughs> oh, Jesus. <laughs> oh, my God. Bill Platt, the headboard is killing my OCD. It's not centered with the bed. I agree with Bill. I said that. Yeah, no, it's infuriating. It doesn't make any sense. It's for a king size bed, and they've got a queen size bed on it. Ugh. But then they were able to balance it with two. Oversized for the room, bedside tables, and that's the problem. It's well, that's what adds table. the that's the, the best that really what, adds what, what, what so we much. Have inside of those bedside tables, we're gonna find out. Oh, really? We will. Okay. All right, Rick. How about you do the honors and open this door for the bathroom? I love the handle. It it allows not much. Uh, oh dear. Now uh, see, uh, see what I was talking about on this door. I think that's puke. I don't know if that's soap scum and moisture, to be quite honest, and not just make it out of... Well, if it it's soap scum too... and moisture, wouldn't it could be up here as well? It's too big. It looks like vomit. Dark me. photon. <laughs> it looks like vomit. Fire at will, someone says. I think that's puke, DJ too. Xfinity X1, did you watch the Super Bowl? We didn't. I we, mean... Yes, I did, DJ. Thank you for saying a word about it. But I, I just, you know. Here yeah. we have, down here, we have more of the yellow-green. Congratulations to the Chiefs. I wish I could just... Mahomes! Look, 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 look. Look at the grout. Oh, boy, the grout is full of all kinds of treasure. Oh, we're going to have a great time in here with, uh, this bathroom is with so some of the meters. Is this the smallest bathroom in ADR? Huh. <laughs> Somebody's once... That was mine. Was your phone? I don't know. I don't know if we've ever seen a bathroom smaller than this. Yes, we have. We have? Where? Um, this is a pretty small bathroom. Rick, look at all that shit up there. I know it's a... 
breathtaking. Oh my God, it is so bad. Now, did you show and me? you see, Rick, look up there. You see that that oh, little crack up yeah, there? That, is that what? We're gonna have to go in there because I have a feeling we're gonna find some stuff underneath the uh, or on the you know sitting up inside of there. Oh, uh, maybe a contraband location. Yeah, because you see evidence of that it's been messed with. That's what I'm saying. How about this sill here? Oh, I love that. So you, a marble sill is traditional uh, for a Christopher bathroom. Christopher Aguilar says, King's Court and Noble Motel had smaller bathrooms. I don't know. King's Court bathroom is not this small. He's but see, famous, but King's Court, they don't have the, they had a, um, a little, you know, you step, it's just a shower. It's on a bathtub. So it made it feel a little bit bigger. The Noble. Yeah, I'm trying to remember the Noble. Basically, the door frame. You know, this also, is the yeah, door frame. It's worth the, mentioning the this trim. isn't a real door. It doesn't latch closed or anything. It's, it's a just, It's just a closet door that they... It's just, and they, it's nothing. They put a handle on either side. Yeah. That's it. There's no latch or It lock. never had any kind of a doorknob. No. Probably the old door did, because you see up here they added this bar here so they could fit this door. They cut it down... And then put an extra piece where the header should be. Yeah, I don't think they cut it down. yeah, they, they did cut it they down. They did cut it down. <clears throat> they oh. cut it down. And I then, don't think they cut it down. I just think that it didn't fit, so they put that extra piece up there to keep it. Now, look, they even built the door stop yeah. in, at that position. Yeah. Oh, look! It used to have a magnetic closer. <laughs> oh, God. oh, that's what it was. Look at the bottom. There should be one down there, too. No? No, it's just on the top. But it used to have a magnet right here. A magnet I think it closer. actually still works. Hold on. It does. Or maybe not. No, it's holding it, actually. I'm no, see? It a little, but it doesn't hold it great. Let me turn my... Uh... Oh, wow. What technology? They're using a cabinet latch Lights. system. Basically. It's incredible. It's amazing. I never would have thought to do that. Yeah, go ahead. All right, here, Rick, turn yours on over there so we're not completely behind you on the wall there. Is there a, a switch? Oh, there's one here. Here we go. I was, like, going crazy. I'm like, what the fuck are you seeing? I must be in the twilight zone. I can't even see that. <laughs> That's nice. It well, is. It's normal for me because I can't see things a lot of times. Hey, Rick, you hungry? That's lead paint, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> it explains a lot about Rick. You can Rick. tell because when you chew on it, it's sweet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. All right, let's do the bed. Well, let me get some gloves on because I've been a little bit... Uh... Oh, good. You got... I'll be careful with these because the other gloves won't fit. Coffee Beard says, stop eating lead paint, Rick. Why do you do that? They're just going to be harder to put on. I to pass it's going to be so, so hard. Bad. I want to just drop. <laughs> now they're all wet inside. It's going to be hard to put <laughs> your on. Your hands going to be filthy. It's like you just put your whole hand in your mouth. Got it all the way in. Oh, my God. I wish there was a button I could push that goes to, like, not commercial, but, you know, like, anything. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Or just, like, a please stand by board yeah. card. That would be perfect. Hang in there. With some elevator music. All right. Predictions. How bad's the bed going to be? I, I think it's going to be pretty fucking I think bad. this is going to be a, a three. This room's going to be a three. Uh, okay. That's, this bed's going to be so nice. You'll see. Oh, the pillows look great so far. Oh, I, I love this platform, too. Oh, oh this wonderful... Look at this. Uh, plywood. Yeah, but they the have the corner. I, that. I've never seen any... They don't on that side. I've never seen anything like this. It's, we have. We've seen this before. 
There's not a well. Hell, like last this when we a couple here. weeks ago when we were at King's Court, they had the <clears throat> just a board between the the mattress and the box. Out of nowhere, yeah, but this seems to be like, like suspended, like a paving board or something. Looks like an army. <laughs> it does. It, it's it's military uh, <clears throat> regulation. <laughs> Anybody got a dime or a <laughs> bounce off? Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> Present pillow. Well. It's a Holiday Inn. It's a Holiday Inn pillow. The other side of the pillowcase. It doesn't look it doesn't stand. that bad. That's amazing. Wow. So far. I mean, I got to give it to you. The... This blanket doesn't look terrible. That has terrible. no burns marks in it. Doesn't have any burns. Boom! Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Oh my god. <laughs> I'm sorry I ruined it. <laughs> we'll never know. <laughs> nope, nothing on here. Pillows are nice. Wow. Rick, you might be right. This is a shock. This is a true shock. I'm not, well, Don't throw the, the clean linens on the floor. All right, let's go. We have a thermal blanket. Thermal blanket. Now, it has how many it doesn't cubes have, on it? It has no hair. I haven't seen any hair on it. You guys see What's any hair What's right that right there? Uh, and nothing. Okay, so you got a few over there now? At nope. least one? Nope. All right, let's roll it down. Move it. I can't believe this. Huh? Allison Ross says, I'd like to make Rick uncomfortable by saying that I would die for a sniff of his armpits. Hit me up anytime, Daddy. Oh, my God. Jesus. Oh, yeah, look. You can smell his uh, dangling tags as well. Oh, she doesn't know about those. Oh, not yet. You just you ruined my chances with her. Don't tell her about those skin tags. It's more to love, honey. <laughs> now, that does look like at least a little mark on it. But, all right, so I'm a oh, little... We've, we've got some stainage here. It looks like paint. It looks almost like letters. It's a message. It's, it's like paint. <laughs> I'm really surprised so far. Bed bug cover. No, it's just no, a mattress no, cover. It's just a pad. Just a pad. It is built in. No, it's not. Under this, it's under this. See, it's and this is a mesh cover. It's not zipped. It's just a. Oh. It just comes off. You got there. I'm sorry. You get back. What was that? It looks like just a red piece of lint. Yeah, it's really minimal. All right. Well. All right, we got some stuff. Uh, oh, uh, yeah. I told you, it can oh, never yeah. be oh, perfect. Yeah. Oh, oh, yeah. okay. Now, let's see how dry it is. <laughs> I mean, it is stained. Ugh. Oh, Rick. Oh. It's good. Oh, no. it's really a, oh. It's a great bag, man. There's no way. No. You never know until you took all that off. If they had... All the lemons were good. If they had a cover over this, I'd give them a little more... It did. We just took it off. No, it did. I'm saying fully covered in a oh, zippered... Okay. Zipped up. Thing. Yeah. How's the other... Yeah, how's the underside look? I don't know. Let's go. No, uh, no, no. I want you to help me stand it up. Oh, I see. That way. Oh, dear. Oh, dear. Oh. Oh my god. My is that a wet spot? It, no chase? It's a giant. You were the one on the bed. I was over on this side. Oh, uh, what a no disgusting. Here. But. Rick, that's a giant puddle of like pee. urine. When that half is yeah. dead. Uh huh. All right, so. It's a one and a half then. Look, look, it, it turned the perfectly like silver embroidery to fucking brass. There's, this is horrible. 
Oh, no. It can't, why can't we ever get a passing bed? Why? Why is that? It was so promising. So you can never can pull apart a bed where it's just like, oh, my God, it's amazing. Everything's perfect. All right, I dare you. Dare you to what? Check the odor. Take a sniff. How much? Just, just don't touch it. Come close. You can plug your Instagram. <laughs> Not detectable or yes? It smells, like, it smells like, you know, when you walk into someone's house that has like seven cats and there's... Oh, like, okay, like, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Cat yeah, air. okay. It smells like that? Yeah. Let's roll it over here. Just lay it down. Oh, dating, dating, they said dating site Rick would love this bed. I believe that. Rick's new character on Twitter. Uh, turn it up. I actually would just lay on the wood. Rick, can you bring that picture up on your phone of that man? This is fucking weird. How, 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 what? It's like dripping shit. It's like they have the glue. Is it dripping? Yeah, it's like uh, dripping like wet concrete. Like the glue. What? The adhesive. That they used to slap these pieces of wood on here. Are you sure that there's no... It's not pee that you're... No, look, look, look. You can see it all on the inside of here. Oh, I see. And it's, it's <clears throat> hard. It's like an icicle. Now, I found a picture of Rick on a gay dating... A gay senior's dating website. Don't ask me why I was on there. But uh, here's Rick. As you can see, he's um, looking for love. So if anyone out there is interested, then you can go and check Rick out. Gay seniors. Rick, why don't you recreate that photograph for us right now? No, it's the other way. It's the other way. <laughs> oh my god. This is not <laughs> me. Hold on, let's take one more look how how hot you look in this photo. <laughs> And it's for Baltimore gay dating, <laughs> and this is like the front screen. This is like an it was example. an it was an ad on a porno website that I was an on. An ad on a porno website. Yeah. And they stole my image, your likeness, or a likeness of me, if I wasn't better looking. But thank God I am. Oh, it does have a lot of chest hair. Okay, let's lift this up because Cochise took a a preview and he's he looked excited. <laughs> I took a peek. I think uh, there's something interesting under there. Oh really? Oh yeah. Wait, Which way do you want to go? What is that? A corn nut? <laughs> yeah, it looks like a it's a peanut. Thanks. <laughs> uh, which way should we lift this? I don't know. We usually, but since we went that way, let's go this way. What? Roach. Ew. Oh, God. Oh, there's roaches everywhere. Tons of them. Oh, Colony. no. We found the home. Oh, fuck. Yep, there's yeah, one it's, right here. Yeah, they're all, they're, they're in this corner here. You see? Woo! Oh, buddy. Oh, God. Oh, they're crawling up over here. Oh, they're getting on the linen stand. <laughs> Hey guys, you're famous. What do you think, people? There's a roach down here, Dan. Yeah, there's a bad Oh, one. he's a big oh, oh, oh! Oh my god, Rick, I just saved your life. <laughs> what happened? Fell what happened? Seal. Okay, so we have a cockroach infestation. There's a dead cockroach on this. Or is it? Is it? Is that dead? Oh, well, don't do that. You'll flick it up on me. Yeah, I want to know what the what, what's up with this. Oh, there's so oh, many more. No. Oh! oh, no. Look, they're all underneath to the... Oh, my gosh, they oh, are. Oh, fuck me. Oh, no. Oh, Dan. Oh, ah! oh! <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Oh, 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 it's just, it's, it's horrendous. Right, so, oh, there's another guy over here. So, I, the bed is really going down, Dan. <laughs> yeah, I think, I think my rating has depleted. I think has it went down to like depleted, a zero. Yeah. <laughs> what about that? Look at that there. That looks like, it's paint. It's paint. 
but there are roaches all over this thing. Uh, yeah, I was like, I was like, what did you see? Because we lifted it up, and I'm like, there's nothing under here. And then I'm like, oh, okay, now we have, I, my skin is, yeah, I've got, I've got up. goosebumps, yeah. yeah. Oh my god. Oh, shit. Oof. Hi, guys. Oh! Ugh. They're handing. They'll, oh! There's at. That's at Cockroach Cute. And there's at Cindy Lou. And there's at. Uh, I'm so scared. They were all. They all came out of this lace. washcloth. They were like crawling out of it. Why don't you pick it up and shake it out and see if it. No, shake, shake it out in here. I'm seriously. You can shake it out a little bit better than that. Washcloth, yeah. yeah, I know. Well, there's no roaches in there. Here, try that one, Rich. Or Rick. It's a dirty Pick that up. fucking stained washcloth. Oh, there's two more. That's his napkin. Why? Ugh. Why? I don't understand. What? Oh, you know what? The bed was probably creaking. When they rolled around on it. When and they were, what, 10 years? Screwing. And so they put these down to... To stop the... It was disturbing the roaches. Things. <laughs> Man, this is, un, this is like too much. Oh! Hey, little buddy. Come on, come on, take a ride. Rick? <laughs> Rick, I, I swear to God, I'll fucking flip out. I will flip out. What is wrong with you? Why are you letting this... He's giving it the ride of a lifetime. Oh, well, there he goes. It's coming right for you! Oh. <laughs> Damn. Oh, God. I'm like, I'm freaking out now. How did people like what I was doing? All right, you guys. So we have a bed that is completely infested. Zero. Zero bed. Rick predicted a three. For a second, I thought he was right. He had us in the first half. Not gonna lie. Oops. It was looking very promising with the uh, linen not looking so horrible. Pull that one. All right. Yeah. The bed is completely infested with cockroaches. What a wonderful feeling. You know what? I want to tell that story like. And see, it does have. Yep, yep. Look, now that we've. How uneven the oh, see, it's yeah. See, look at that. Oh well. Oh well. Oh. Um, I lived in an apartment years ago, and it was it was. Oh, don't hurt yourself. I'm good. It was Ready? really bad, and I remember twice waking up at night with roaches, uh, a roach Watch crawling out. on me. <laughs> Uh, it was just a hole, but it looked dark. I knew it'd freak him out. You know how much dark it is. <laughs> dark but I woke up twice and had roach uh, a roach on me, yeah. crawling on me in bed, and I will never ever forget that. I hate even having a fly. You know, holy shit! We're gonna hit y'all that. Who is it? The people under you. Oh shit! Yeah. Yeah, that's no problem. Sorry about that. I knew we were being too loud. Well, what the hell? I didn't think that people actually were here to sleep. <laughs> For fuck's sake, what's wrong with them? Damn, what'd she look like? Was she hot? Did she look hot to trot? She had a guy behind her and he was holding the gun. <laughs> I think it's time for a cigarette break. Time for a smoke break. <laughs> Can I have more bourbon, Rick? Yeah, I'll make another one. Thank you. Oh my god. <laughs> Alright, so I guess. Uh... We have to try to no, muffle it. I was like, well, yeah, we got to muffle it. But at least we got through. The bed, I think, was the same thing. The, the worst part of it. 
Come, come sit over here so we can put everybody on camera. Yeah. We smack You're fucking it. lucky to me to sit there. <laughs> We should have got a basement room. Here, wait a minute. Let's pull it down a little bit through the edge of that damn thing. I think you might be okay. Not there. You're probably okay right in the middle. Not either corner. I know. Gabby Hornback, right, thank like you, right darling, there. so yeah. much. Oh, wait, well, look out for the bed bug tag. Um, is there any bed bugs? We got a whisper. I don't want to wake those people up. She's had a long weekend of sucking cock. How, so, do you, how do you know what she's done? Of selling her asshole. They might actually be... For pennies on the dollar. The only people in the place that actually have a job. <laughs> Rick, why can't we see you? All right, here we go. Oh, wait. It goes down like this. There we go. Oh, oh, Coach, grab that fucking ashtray over there. Oh, my God. The room was $60. Was it? Yeah. So, uh... We need help, folks. $60. That was me. That was the bet. Oh, God. <laughs> You're all paranoid. Well, I'm just afraid... Well, if the owners come in and start yelling at us, I guess that would be a good thing, right? We'd be like, wait a minute, before we leave, we have something to show you. It's good content. Sadly, it's empty. <clears throat> Last round. Uh, DJ Spinning X1, what would Cab Calloway say about that room? He would say, Heidi, Heidi, yuck. Heidi, <laughs> <laughs> Heidi, yuck. <laughs> I'm riffing here. Christopher Aguilar says three fifty nine too much. How do how to know? <laughs> that's, well, I won't that's go. People are always like, "Why do you? Why are we men? What does this have to do with Cab Calloway?" They always ask that. Right, like people so, who don't know that. All right, so this is the great grandson of Cab Calloway and the legitimate son of Jay Z and the legitimate son of Jay Cab Calloway. Z. The, the uh, American icon. Yes, American icon of... Heidi, Heidi, early, Heidi Ho. Of the first... Uh, I guess it would be like from the 20s or late teens he made his... No, he started in the... Well, he started... 30, early, doesn't look at me. <laughs> he, st he started his entertainment at a very young age, but it, in terms of by the time he probably was, you know, running the... The whole thing, I bet you he was probably well, he also had thirty. A sister, a very famous sister, really Blanche. Blanche kind of. So it's probably around nineteen thirty that he hit his mark, and he was uh, famous at that point in time. Mm -hmm. We were he trying, good. hoping for the city to agree to save a piece of history, but of course we can't do that. We just have to put up a, a stupid. That time at Cochise, because I met his dad, Peter. Is trying to save the Cap Calloway house on Druid Heights Avenue and um, from demolition. So I went and uh, met up with them to go film inside the house. And then Cochise and I were blinking or winking at each other. Winking? I, I got out of my car and Dan was already there setting up his camera. And I went, oh, geez, is that hunk of man, Dan Bell? God, who let that walrus go? <laughs> Called the Baltimore Zoo. <laughs> what? What did you call them to ask for permission to ask him out? <laughs> Who's? Let me see your tusks. <laughs> you I big old. Him? You big old elephant seal. <laughs> oh, no. Dan tried to talk it off as elephantitis. <laughs> um. We're back, live. Amazing. Hopefully it won't Miracle. cut the video into two parts. You know the owner's outside with some kind of a dish. <laughs> he's, he's trying to block the signal. <laughs> oh, Lord. 
Uh, okay, yeah, we're back. Hello, Emily Vasquez says, uh, can we have more episodes with Brennan shirtless? Um, we do have a uh, shirtless Brennan coming up in Char New Orleans or Charleston, I forgot. <laughs> Old, fat, stoned lesbian. <laughs> <laughs> Looking for love. <laughs> yes, Rosie O'Donnell has joined us. <laughs> hey, I used to really have a great thing going. But then I kind of got tired of all the attention. And then I had a little bit of plastic surgery, and now I'm back. Is this supposed to be Rosie O'Donnell? Oh, my um, God. I mean, talk about... <laughs> hey, you want some chocolate? <laughs> Rosie does look good. She she is really <coughs> she's lost weight. Oh my god. I know. Every time I said that we shouldn't have removed the washcloths. That's probably why they're bitching, because all that fucking Oh man. What can you do? Wanna stick something else in the corners? Go right ahead. I'm good. I have had enough of these bed quarters. <laughs> All right, Rick, let's do a soap test. Grab uh, three soaps for us. We have four soaps. And what we're going to do is we're going to... Uh, four? Wow. We're going to all test them out. We actually have five. This is a record. I'm not sitting down anymore. Oh, come on. It's so much fun. <coughs> just, just don't go up and down. This is the first time in a, one of these crack whore motels that we've been yelled at, but uh... there's a black mark on mine. Well, don't talk yet. We're gonna we're we're all gonna discuss how it smells. There's Rick, a bunch of black ones in mine. Rick, get 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 in your chair and get in. Put, can, come in here. All right, all right. So we have this is finesse. Finesse moisturizing. You know what finesse soap. is? Finesse is to be able to do something smoothly that you really know the ins and outs. You have a lot of finesse. So let's see how much finesse this soap has. Thank you, uh, Jess Bishop. <clears throat> Great surprise to see you guys on a Sunday. Love you. Cheers. Cheers. Me up since my dad had open heart surgery yesterday. Well, I hope your dad's doing well. I hope that everything works out. Don't let him watch this show. Oh, Stephen oh, King is back oh, at work. He's back the at work. The typist here. is back. How, how much do you want to bet there's roaches in that? I think we haven't gone. We have to. We're going to check that out next, but there's going to be roaches in it. I'm telling you right Making now. A little nice All right, so on. Dan, um, I'm on. smelling it. Hold on, I'm opening this. I'm going to show I'm people. surprised. Was this made inside? Look, well, it's, you know. It's a generous, well, thick it, slice of it, soap. I will give them that. It's the least offensive smelling soap I've ever encountered in this show. I made a friend. <clears throat> What did you do? Artwork with it? That's I sure did. So I'm an artist. I noticed that. Here, I, sm sm smell that. I, I just scraped some with the. Yeah, I yeah. think I think it's. I mean, yeah. it's kind of strong, but it's not it, horrible. It's not terrible. I right? Mean, it's a pleasant odor. If we had to have this compared to Pavi, if you needed some finesse, right? This is this is a little bit more yes, finesse than Pavi. A little more finesse. <clears throat> but how does it taste? I've never done this before. This is unbelievable. Dan is going to contribute. I'll uh, do it. Nice I'll do toast. it. I've never done right, this here. before. We have to dink it. Cheers. Cheers. D okay, uh, how many seconds? All. No, we should do... Here, set your timer. Somebody set it... Here, Rick, let me see your phone. We're going to set a timer. 60 seconds. Oh, oh no! Yeah, 60 seconds. We have to have the soap in our <laughs> mouth. Six seconds. See, I hate doing this because it's like some dumb YouTube... Uh, crap and I hate that but all right <clears throat> okay we ready yes it's like Christmas story okay so. I've never done this I've never put oh. soap in my mouth I I had I, I would have put soap put in my mouth as a child if I swore okay love you too Emily Hale okay here we go let's do give it a word, please 
Hit the timer and let them see it when you get going. Okay, ready? Yeah. Set. One, two, three, go. Me hurts all. Oh, he's cheating. Put your hook down. This is so bad. Oh god. It was really bad. It's alright. Stop stomping around. It tastes awful. What? That was disgusting. But it smelled better. Why did we do that? We've never, was there a demand for that? No, I just never tried it before. Oh, no, we're, it's a, we can spit in the same sink. We're that close. Like, Rick has to, like, be dramatic and make that fucking noise. He's so loud. Downstairs, they're probably like. I know, like, I know, they're calling oh. me yeah, they're gonna call the front desk. We are seriously gonna be kicked the fuck out of here. If you would not done that stupid dramatic vomit thing, it was so loud it rocked the whole building. I had no idea. You never do. At least our So when the owner goes, so you can tell them. I, what I, we're I'm, doing. I'll tell him I'm sorry I have coronavirus. <laughs> I'm trying to keep it together. Start coughing on <laughs> And then I will. Use the uh, DJX20 X1 says, What did Rick buy from Kmart? Any sad eyed horse? No. We bought clothes. I bought a. Uh, I bought clothes. Socks. Socks. And he bought socks. And then I bought. Uh, a uh, Christmas sweater for next year. John Kirshner says this beats the hell out of Super Bowl any day. I Does agree. it? Thank really? you <laughs> very much. And Santa Christ 300. Santa Christ. <laughs> Rick wins flawless victory. Any fatalities? <clears throat> it was disgusting. I've never had soap in my, uh, put in my mouth like that, but it tasted really bad. It's salty. And you notice how it hits any wet part of your mouth? Yeah. It just goes right in. Yeah, it goes right in, and oh. it's like... And then then it's like trying to turn off the gag reflex. Yeah, it, it was really bad. Oh. Really, really bad. So uh, we have another oh. cigarette, and then uh, I think we should just go right ahead and check out that thing. But we got to be quiet. All right. Make sure they can hear us. Because if we talk too softly, they won't be able to hear when you're fucked up on iPhone 11. No, see, I took the case off. So now you can hear better. Can Let's you go. hear us, everybody? Um, Silver Stacks, thank you so much. Silver Stacks. Says we rock. And that sounds listen. great. Um, good luck, I, TT. Whose idea was it to include Dr. Seuss in Islands of the Adventure. I personally feel like it doesn't belong there, but that's just me. I love Universal of Death, but I never understood why Dr. Seuss land is there. Well, good luck, IT. You know, feel free to share more of your manic thoughts in the Super Chat, because we're here for you. I mean, we love manic thoughts, especially when you share them with your cash. So thank you. Oh, yes. Thank you. Please. The more manic yeah, thoughts, the better. If you're having better. more manic thoughts, you know, put in more money. Yes. And, and we'll, we'll definitely be here for you. We'll, we'll, thank we'll you. read every word. 
<laughs> oh, hey, it's almost, it is. It's another manic Monday. I wish it was Sunday. That's my fun day. <laughs> no, it's a manic Monday. It is. It's a manic Monday. <laughs> You're welcome. I just totally ruined your feed trademark violation. Uh, did Cochise lose weight? Yes, he did. Uh, he has no money for food. I lost weight, too. So he's currently... Uh, Who notices that? Because they never knew me currently when I was fatter. Sarah Lasher, thank you, darling. Appreciate that. Glad everyone's having a good time. Now we are we are going to look skip, inside. We're going to skip a couple things, but I want to do this before get in trouble. the heroin or dope kicks in downstairs. We don't want to wake them up again. Uh, I uh, wish that they had at least used their gate shot for a nice night of sleep. And hell, if they've got the shakes in the morning, I want you to sleep. So shoot your gate shot now, folks, down below us, and go to sleep. What's a gate shot? Um, Polo Lerma says, you guys should come to Vegas. I can only imagine the crap you'll find at the cheap motels here. Well, Polo, we actually have plans to do Vegas. Um, we're probably looking at, I'm going to say next... I would say next fall, like November-ish. What's October, October November. Well, going to Ve Las Vegas to do... <clears throat> that would make more sense. Yeah, that's what I want to do. Because I want to get settled in South America before... You know, not that we wouldn't do something this summer if that came up. If you were back here and we could coordinate it, that would be fun. But maybe something of less of an exotic location, just keep it local. No, I want to do Vegas. I don't mean that we won't go to Vegas, but I mean in the summer... When you are around, oh. you could do something else and not have to make it a. Big or you guys could thing. just fly down to Ecuador. I'm not going to no fucking South American country. <laughs> I'm just kidding. I'd love Ecuador to. in the summer could be nice because that's your that's your winter. Well, sort of. It's a wet season, I think. Oh, it's the wet season. I think so. Oh, great. Yeah, let's go down to Ecuador so I can have so, thunderstorms every day. Right, right. So they have like three hours of sunshine. Tropical storms, yeah. Yeah, the kinds that are like a deluge. So like it rains the, all the time. The water. Yeah. water. Uh, Abra Wilder says, don't quit your day job, Rick. I don't have one. <laughs> <laughs> me neither. This is it. Look, Rick, you left me hanging right there. Me and I put my hand I'm up. so sorry. Okay, stay tuned as we <laughs> smoke more cigarettes. Uh, we are going to be pulling that out of there. But um, that fridge? Yeah, I have to because you know it's going to be under the, in, the, in the fridge in the, part, especially in the back. It's roaches. going to be roaches Hell in the compressor. Oh. We pull it out of that enclosed. I'd little be very hutch. surprised if we're going to have a cucaracha dance. Mandy C says, "Say hi to Mandy C, Rick." Mandy C. I look like who? Hi, Mandy C. What did that person C. say? I look like who? I'm about to fight someone. Coach, she looks like a welfare Bob Ross. Yeah. Oh, <laughs> my oh, God. No. You know what? I'm done. You know what, Dan? <laughs> you told me people would like me, and that's why I started doing these fucking videos with you. But Coach, I, he's, yeah. he's leaving. Paint us a pretty picture. No, don't make any noise. Don't walk. <laughs> don't move. Just get out of it. Just, just sort of Bob crawl Ross. on the floor so that they're off of the camera and it look like you We have it. light sleepers downstairs. They're probably from FEMA or something. Sure. They were probably placed here by FEMA. This is where the FBI put them. Bob Ross. <laughs> That's why the guy had a gun. A Maybe even for the say. FBI, they had a badge or ready to. I wish I could get welfare. <laughs> um, Boy, who is. do we have here? It's really the pot. Sophie, calling the kettle black when they came. Love the content, my That's dudes. Really ADR cool. Arkansas, please. That would be a good one, yeah. Scumfrog. I lived in Quenza for three years. It's not bad. <clears throat> little Squish, love you, Rick. Yeah, I'm gonna visit hey, Quenza. Thank I'm, you, little squish. I'm gonna be in um Waikil. Tell Coach he's <clears throat> I'm about to start yelling at people. Make me a moderator. I'm gonna ban every single person that talks about me. You'll be on your phone going click, 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 click. click. <laughs> all right, you guys, you ready for this? I'm ready to give you all Cochise's private number. 
Hi, Michael. Are we ready for this? Cancer cures smoking. Hmm? Cancer cures smoking and something. I guess that's true. true. We're like old school. I love you, Coach. Somebody just said, too. Ren A, thank you so much, darling. Daddy's getting hard again. Somebody just said that. They wanted to hear it. Rick, Rick, what? Rick, blow us a kiss. Well, you got a couple winks in there. All right, if that doesn't drive you. Thank you, True Seed. I don't know what will. All right, let's let's go. Let's do it. ADR Colorado. Hey, I would love ADR Colorado, wouldn't you? I would love to go. To yeah, Colorado. Rick would be so fucked up the whole time we're there, he wouldn't be able to move. We'd be just walking around, passing blunts and stuff. That would be great. Of course, Brendan and, and Dan don't partake, so it'd be. Neither do I. I don't Coach Cheese and I would have to try. No, I don't. If you're in Colorado. And by the way, when we do ADR, I guess if I was in Colorado, when yeah, we right. do when we do ADR Vegas, we're bringing Coach Cheese with us too. So. That's uh, so uh, really good. You're ready to lose a couple. The stump frog. Ecuador even uses U.S. Minute. currency. He, I know. Does he I'm realize sorry. that he's going to be the one that has to cross dress if he's coming instead of Section Eight? Okay. Anyway, back to what I was saying. Uh, M P W Michael. Uh, thank you. Hey, very Daddy much. Rick. I love your personality. Ever been with a furry wolf? Wolf. I uh, can't say I've ever been with a man. Never. No, he didn't say a man. He said a furry woof woof. Well, furry woof woof, it's a, I mean, if it's a a wolfress. That depends on if your suit comes with it's, a knot it's... or not. <laughs> Rick, you should be so happy that anyone finds you a Jockstrap cowboy, I love that. <laughs> you should be so thrilled. Oh, God. Thank you from you Greece. At least show him your butthole. Come on. What the fuck? Oh, Lord. Oh, my God. Show your gay fan your asshole. Does my gay fan want to see my asshole? Well, we can't do that. It would demonetize your stream. Show the furry your butthole. I'll just make an impression of it. <laughs> that was a worm coming out. My tapeworm was saying hi. <laughs> Herb was talking to you. Here, could you please give me a little more, Dan? Oh, my God. Give me the hand. Come on, give me the hand. No. I, please. No, you're making too much fucking noise. Hello. I'm Rick Stapler. I love living here, and it's really good because there's lots of nutritional things in his stool because it eats so fast and swallows it whole. Quiet. So... Hey, I'm, I'm kind of down here. I'm kind of shy. Me, <laughs> <laughs> uh, I really love oh being God. on camera. This is so exciting. Jesus fucking Christ! <laughs> 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 oh, I'm ready to pass out. Where's my bourbon? Where did it go? Oh, there it is. Oh, here, here, cheers on that one. Tapeworm oh. really did a great thing there. That oh. was me. <laughs> a little sippy poo, I can't, I, Can we please? <laughs> so what do you want to do now, Tim? We're gonna do. We're gonna do the fridge. But they they thought it was funny, so yeah, it's I, all good. I Okay, it's not, we're gonna do the first. Uh, oh my god. <laughs> Sammy Moore. <laughs> Sammy. Sammy. Rick's tapeworm, don't I let that. I couldn't love you anymore. Sammy. Sammy says, don't let that tapeworm bear your seed. <laughs> that, <laughs> that tapeworm is my baby. <laughs> and, uh, uh, MPW Michael, uh, I hope you enjoyed that wonderful thing that we just did for you. There's nothing in the drawer. Wow. Is there like a roach there? No. Oh, okay. okay. <coughs> All right. Why is my chair breathing? It's exhaling. Wow. Wow, wow, wow. 
Where's the lighting? We got to do this as quietly as possible. Okay. All right, inside looks normal, fine. It's not dirty. I think this is nice. Go, Dan. What's this under here? Ew, what is that? <laughs> I can't see. It's right there. What is it? I'll put the light on. You get no. the camera on it. Ew. It's underneath. Of it's the a shelf. piece of cardboard. Is that all it is? Yeah, it's just cardboard. Oh, man, it looks so cool. I really did. Do we want to slide this down in the uh, yeah. furniture? Quiet, 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 quiet. <laughs> We're, we're at the Shush Motel. Shit, the entire back is open. We could have just. No, oh, Roach! Roach! Look out, look out. Oh, yeah. Okay. If there's one, there's more inside. Wow, I don't really see any. Look at this, look at this fucking plastic uh, thing to get. This is a, a little, little drip, extra, yeah. And it, it evaporates in there, so it's probably pretty disgusting. It is. <clears throat> it's, it looks like it has boogers in it. Pull it out. Does it come out? I can't really get it uh, out. Okay. Check in like the dark corner. They're probably underneath the fucking stand. Okay. Yeah, I'm not really... It's clean. Huh. Damn it. Not seeing any roaches. That sucks. Surprising. Really? Because I really would have thought this would be full of roaches because it's so warm. But the back's open, so that's nice. Yeah. Maybe. Maybe. That's good. You want to you put it back? Yeah. We don't have to. No, actually, yeah, fuck it. You paid with uh, cash, right? No. You used a credit card. Yeah. With your name on it. I didn't have a. I didn't have any cash on me. Did you really use a credit card? Yeah. We gotta put this back. Yeah, yeah, yeah of yeah. course. Oh. <clears throat> gonna steal all your money. Yeah, all right. What do you got here? ADR. Right, that's great, Rick. <coughs> Messed it up. That is. We should, we should have like little tick stickers that we slap. We, we, we did. We had some. But we didn't get. But I mean, what joy are we getting out of it? I mean, they're just going to find it when we're not here. Help him, help him. <gasps> oh, oh, shit. Oh, I see where they're all hiding. They're underneath this mat. Ew, There's a rubber mat right. underneath the fridge, and that's where they're all. Oh, that's where they're all hanging out. Get it back out. Here. I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it, I got it. They're underneath this mat. Right, well, let's, let's see how much we can do with this mat. Oh, where are they? Well, two of them. So maybe, maybe under that thing, at the, that little thing at the bottom here, that rounded... Yeah, because look, there's there's a roach case right there. A couple of them. Yeah, so there's got to be a colony inside of this thing. There just has to be. It's under this cabinet. Let's, we got to see it. Oh, come on, Dan. That means I have to like, move the TV. Yes. We got to see it. Oh, it's fucking the TV. 
attached. Well, that's good. It won't fall off. <laughs> it won't fall. Is it just stuck in there because of? Wait, maybe it, let's, hold on, just lift it, take the bottom like this and try to lift it. <laughs> nope. All right, well, just tip, just let's tip this thing over. Here, wait a minute. Yeah. How about, can we unplug that thing? The one wire that you noticed, the fridge. All right, give me the wire. There's definitely a roach colony in there, there. Cause see here on the floor, see that roach case? That's an egg. Quit trying and stuff, Rick. That hurts. Here, go help him with the lighting. I'll hold this. Hey, give him the light. Oops, hold on, let me see if I can do it this way. Oh, whoa. It's mold. You want me to reach on further there? On yeah, yeah, yeah. Hey, guys. You see a roach colony anywhere? Uh uh. So weird. You guys see anything? I'll tell you I did, I did. Oh. What? Oh, God. Look in the crack. Let me see. I can't tell you we pull it off. It's going to be just roaches everywhere. No, nope, I don't see much of anything. Oh. Oh. Strange. I guess they're just oh. all over the room. I really think those might have been, you know, scouts looking for dinner for the family back at home under the. Or they could have been just tra they traveled from the bed over to here when we disrupted their. <laughs> well, we are ninety percent quieter than we were before. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Right before we leave. Help okay. him with that. Look at him. Look at him. You wild man. I found the, the plug. Do you think if we had the blinds open, they would have knocked on the window? Uh, oh. Are you kidding? Of course. Push. I'm, push. Pu I'm pushing. Stuck it's on good those enough. things. It's good enough. Honestly, it's good enough. Very good, Rick. Good work. Excellent work. Thank you, Dan. Are we doing swabbing tonight? Yes, let's go into the bathroom and do some swabs. Swabs. It's swab time, everyone. Swabs. Swabs, exciting and new. Swab my crack. Okay, it's festering with goo. Ah, <laughs> <laughs> uh, they're in the bag, in that, in that. Um, yeah, so guys, while I'm on here, let's let's get up to a thousand likes. Let's all click like. And let's get at Curly Cheddar on Instagram up to a thousand followers. Yeah, and let's get Curly Cheddar on Instagram up to a thousand followers. That's it, 518. Let's go a little bit higher. Come on, folks. You can do it. Just press that thumbs up. That makes us so happy. We need. And then you can always go over to Sarah.Rick on Instagram and say hello. No, no, no. Follow. Forget your Instagram. Go to Rick Sarah's channel. And go to Rick Sarah on YouTube. And Rick Sarah on Rick on YouTube. Go subscribe and watch his behind the scenes documentary. Yes. It's really good. You know what? I'm just gonna get along. This. All right. So let's show people in here real quick. We'll come in. <clears throat> first things first. Should we what just surfaces? Should we? Do? 
the Coach, curtain, definitely. Coach, should we just, should we push that up and see if there's anything up there first? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Are you up for the challenge? You need something for me to help you with uh, elevation. I got it. Okay, you got long reach. Watch debris in your face. Yeah, you stay under the tile and then push one way or the other. Just push it up on top of the tile. Okay. But I can't push, slide it up on Slide top it up onto it. Oh, oh, oh. Push here, it up here, first and slide it onto the tiles. First you have to get it up all the way. Then slide it. There you go. Slide it back. Look, there's the other tiles that were <laughs> Keep going. You got it about the same depth. I'm getting some resistance. What if I'm pushing it? That's what I'm saying. Whatever it is, probably on that side, not this side. Right, so well, push, take that, take that, and put it on the put other it side. Away. Uh, well, it's worth a look while we already had it down. Here, 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 here. here. And take, put the light up there, too. See if we can see. What is that? I think I might have something. Over near the light fixture? Um, no, here, take this. Careful. I am. What is that? Uh, it looks just like a discarded cough drop. That's an odd thing to find up there. Yeah. Odd. I, what? Oh, there's a bunch of cough drops. There's a bunch of cough drops. There's some wish you throw a bunch of cough drops up on But there's top. there's something in the middle of them, but I can't tell what it is. Here, let me zoom in a little bit. It's what is that? Where is it? Is it over here? Oh, it's hairy. I don't know what it is. It just looks like a, a weave. Oh my god. Grab it. Can you reach it? I think, yeah. Here, give me some. Just keep the light near, like, up. <laughs> Looks like a dead mouse. No, I can't reach it. Okay. No, there's no way. How far is it, would you say? It's right yeah. there. Okay, so push that tile up and push it back. All right. Well, and it'll slide towards you, or I'll do it. All right, well, let's slide this one back. And I want to see well, what's on. Wait, wait until we have the camera. Wait, wait until we're, because we're still streaming. So let's stream, but we'll, I want to... I want to see what's on this side. All right, let me get up here. <clears throat> okay. Here, let me... Here, I'll move this, and then let me get out of here, and I'll let you guys situate yourselves. I'll put this down. Oh, this is exciting, isn't it, you guys? Hello. A I'm sneak peek in the I'm ceiling. For a living. Rick's going to show me how it's done. <laughs> Rick. All right, nothing on that panel. I can't tell what that crap is over there. It could be just insects. That's it, right there on the ledge. You just touched it, Rick. That's it. You have it. That's not hard. hair. It's a piece it's of insulation. Rock insulation. Oh. Don't you know anything about fashion? <laughs> <laughs> hey, I didn't expect to see a bunch of cough drops up there either. 
Let me take through this. It's just crazy. Can you give me the light again on the camera? Is mm -hmm. it all? Good Lord, look at that. Interesting. All right, there's sanitary. What do you see here, folks? I really can't tell. Maybe you can give us a clue of sitting up there. There's nothing, I can't see anything. Any comments? Is this thing zoomed in? Oh yeah, that's a... Um, roaches, dead rats, nothing. I'll go with nothing. But yeah, probably mouse droppings, I would assume. Some of those. What, I was hungry. Oh, you eating a little bit of soap, Coaches? Well, we had a look up into the... Um, I, I kind of want to see what's, just like take one of these and look around. We can, but it's gonna be loud. Yeah. We're going to have to stay. Yo, you could probably stand on one of these chairs. Yeah. Now you may see after I have put the ceiling back together and show my, my skill. No evidence we were out there. That's good, Rick. Now I'll show my face. All right, Coach Hees, could you bring the swaps in? <laughs> Cause you just do a little swab on any of the grout. <clears throat> just, just any of these grouts. You just follow a line on the grout. Hey, Give it a nice, spin a nice going. spin. I'm loving that. Oh, okay. Yeah. That's enough. Maybe don't want to go too far. Oh, sorry. Is that too no, much? you can do it. Just go ahead and try it. It'll be fine. Yeah, but if you get it totally loaded up like that, you'll get a. Uh, zero or a nine 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 which means it wasn't a good sample anyway so now we're calibrating the swab test system the system short plus let's see that water in there the hygienia wow it's really cool. it's really dark so the fluid now will be examined with whatever this technology is that help us to read ATP in the DNA of whatever was on the surface to give a. Do I hit okay? Mm -hmm. Yes. To give us a comparison. Place your bets. And uh, I think, I would I think say, it's too dirty. I think the water is too dirty. I'm saying it's probably. I think it's going to be zero. Two thousand, three thousand, nine thousand. I think it's going to be zero. Eight thousand four hundred fifty. That's the big. That's the second largest reading we've ever had. Other than my belly, we had a ninety-one or something, right? On that one episode, ninety-one twenty or something, something like, like that. that yeah. But yeah, so what we're looking at up here is it's active, horrible, active. active mold growth that can make you sick. But tell me, um, yeah, what is it? Is it good or is it horrible? Is it horrible, Dan? Anyway, uh, it is horrible. <laughs> but is it can make you know it can make you sick if you're in here taking a shower and uh, you're stirring up the the um, <laughs> You're flashingly blind. <laughs> it's like you a, a, you're stirring up the, the the you know the the mold spores. Uh, that's what you're gonna get. Very dirty. You want me to do the shower head? Might as well. Because we're gonna get at least I'm gonna I'm gonna say five hundred on the shower head. Shower head? Let's see. At least. Hmm. Hmm. Don't touch the wand. Make sure you don't touch the wand. Oh no. I don't know. Get in there, so twirl it. Be, yeah. Could be in the hundreds. Four or five hundred, I could guess with that. So Dan, you're 
guess I would concur. At least. Because of the mold spores that are present on the wall. So what do you think about this? I think it's going to be 800. Okay, he's even going to go Did you take the other sample out? Yes. Okay. Allow me to help you. Oh, you got it? That's right. Okay, well, there you go. You helped. Okay. All right, well, it's not certainly overloaded. It's it's, it's going to be gross. It's going to be a, a good sample, and it's going to give us... I'm, a, I'm actually... I'm going to say 1,000 now. 1,000 now. Just by looking at the reagent. So you're 800, I'm 500, and Dan's 1,000. I think it's even going to be 1,000 plus. Oh, wow. no! It's clean enough to... To kiss and lick and make love to. It's got a one. That's amazing. Well, my only guess is... It's not active. Two showers. What? What? I would run right home. Shall we do the curtain? After here. And that way I'm going to assure yes. I have water scalding enough to remove a layer of my skin to assure that I'm not still possessing any fluid I obtained while being here. Yeah, anywhere along the bottom. The bottom of the curtain. Let's see how dirty it could really be. This one doesn't look as bad as some we've seen. But as we all know, looks can be deceiving. Yes. I love when it looks like it's fine, and then it gives you a 999. Yeah. Right. Hey, like that, I pull it right now. I'm almost a poet. And it looks fine, but it's a 999. Oh, boy. Reminds me of my favorite beer, Magic Hat number nine. Number nine. That's I love right. that stuff. It's ready. <clears throat> Dan didn't like it too much. It was you don't have to shake it as much as like a baby that's crying. Sorry. I took a... <laughs> I got nothing. 500. I used to love Who's a bad Newcastle guy? Brown. The, this, I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to say, t I'm gonna say 1,500. 1,500. I'm going to go with 50. So Rick's saying low today. 200. Ooh, 51. Rick was closest. 51? So basically, it might Damn. be that they're in some ways cleaning. Because you see over here, like, that grout over there is clean. Mm -hmm. It's not clean, clean, but it's cleaner. So maybe the clean person's just not touching. Up high. Up high. They're just cleaning down oh. here and not paying attention Look to. Look at that floor. Coaches, what have you been stepping in? Dirt. Disgusting. Well, do you step in dog poop again? <laughs> That's what I'm known to do. <laughs> um, take a swirl inside that ice bucket. A swirl in the bucket is always nice for a ride. Oh, it's wet. Oh, it's wet. Ew. Oh. All right, yeah, go oh, ahead. Oh, there you go, buddy. Go ahead and do a, um... Wow, Dan, this is so exciting. This has been an awful room. I'm surprised. I mean, I knew it was bad when we came in. I just didn't realize it was going to be this bad. I thought that we were going to see some real life prostitutes and such. We could have this extra B roll, but damn. Can you guys keep it down? You're throwing off my game. Gently shake it. Like a sleep. You shouldn't gently shake it. You just. Go up and down like for oh, five there seconds. Go. There Come it's on, you know how to go up and down. You taught me. Ew. <laughs> Please. We did switch out. Make your predictions. Uh, I'm going to say 100. 200. Rick, inside the ice bucket. 50. A hundred ninety. Okay, there we go. But let's put some ice in there. Yum yum. Mm. That's 
Because they give you the ice bucket. They don't give you a, a liner. This place doesn't have a phone. I just noticed that. Yeah. No phone. Two, I, can, I, can't even, no I can't phone. even make fun of calling room service. Remote? Yes. Yeah, remote. <clears throat> Should we do a TV check? Oh, sure. Let's do it while we do Do you think it. they're going to have pornography on the TV here? I don't think they will. No. We'll just do the remote first. Rick, quit messing with my subject. We're gonna get the power button. Yeah, yeah some volume, some channels. I swear okay. to God, up and like down. a vagina appears right next to my head. Oh, there she is. Some inhalable asbestos fibers, which may have caused the death of at least one woman. Now, with regard to the ovarian cancer risk, a Harvard researcher, Dr. We... Daniel Kramer, has estimated that as many as 10,000 women every year develop ovarian cancer. Turn off. There we go. Are you serious from asbestos? Coming Damn, back. I don't know if we can bring that back or not, then. Damn, I was hoping we could bring it back. I mean, how could that have... Well, the, the timing of that was yeah, just that was amazing. Fun. Amazing. Yeah. We, we we did not set that up, folks, so we just turned the television on and popped Rick on. has to tell that we didn't set it up. We didn't. Text. Yeah, we, we actually have a team outside running a cable in here so we can... <laughs> Next, there's a ghost that's going to come out of the wall. All right, here we go. Uh, Remote control, 300. A hundred. Fifty. Eleven sixty one. That's the dirtiest remote we've ever done. Yes. Dirty remote. Oh my god. You, you sure guys, there, guys, look got, at this. There's got to be a porn channel with it being so dirty. That's what I'm saying. But yeah, this is eleven hundred sixty one. I mean, this is a truly, truly filthy, disgusting. If you were to put this in an incubator, you could watch it literally grow. Like, it's it's well, sustaining we could ecosystem. have little colonies, and each colony would have the name of the hotel. Rick, take take that and turn it on, and let's see if you're right, correct about having pornographic. Please turn the volume down all the way so I don't get hit for music like I did last time. Oh my god! Yeah, I, I I didn't realize they could. Um, you know, charge you, or they could uh, grab music off your live stream and then limit who's allowed to watch. Santa Christ 300. Santa Christ. Bring it back. Santa Christ, Santa Christ, Santa Christ. Oh, we got some Westerns. Some yogurt. Now, folks, Rick believes now that we may have some pornographic channels i am going to disagree i don't think we're going to find any porn on this yeah it's a good family hotel motel it, uh -oh. it, it is bigger than we thought Well, this is riveting. Ladies and gentlemen, while the ADR team searches for porn, it's times like this we should remember. Was that Grease? Grease 2? It's a cool rider. It's Futurama. It's a cool rider. It's a great episode of Futurama. Ooh, oh, my girls. girls. Oh, look at Betty Davis. Her hair is all on gone. Lip sweet surprise. Oh no. Has it never that's, come. It, that's it. She got bad Davis eyes. All right, it's time for a final rating. We're now at 95 minutes. People need to go to sleep. That's right. My God. Everyone's all tuckered out. Um, this is a good swab, I need to. Save this swab. So, um, My chair exhales and inhales when you when you sit on it. It's a feature. <laughs> okay, you guys. Um, 
We're gonna wait for Rick to finish up what he's doing. I thought you were going to sing Betty Davis on us, damn it. No thanks. She makes a <sighs> pro blush. Here, Rick, this is your seat. <clears throat> I forgot about the... You bed. think she's a spy? She's got... Bad as Dave is... Ah! Rick, shut the fuck up. You're so loud. It's not that bad. All right, Rick, can you... Can you scoot in, scoot in, scoot in so we can all... Okay, we can all see each other on Where's here. Oh, It's right here. Oh, thank you. Attention. Attention. See the screen? You need to be on the screen. Okay. All right, so we started out when we got here with an odor. An odor? We saw a little tiny cockroach run across the floor. And then we did the bed, and I was really surprised. The linens all looked okay. The linens and the pillows were actually in decent shape. I would have slept on them. But then when you got beyond this little quilted kind of then, yeah. uh, mattress And then it was all downhill from there. Mm -hmm. All downhill. I lay on the bed. Thank God I find out that it is not saturated of urine. The other half of the bed is. Things I think we've ever seen. I don't know if that's true. It was huge. That And there's just weird marks of white We've had everywhere. entire... Beds now they were twin size. No, well, that is so true. No, that's true. Yeah, yeah. yeah, I think episode. How about when you, what was it? Episode. A lady on um, my one, Facebook group. One, or season two. Can we localize that ashtray? Remember, she said, or no, she's like, you remember that bed with the urine in it? And remember, you and Will picked up the mattress, and it sagged at the bottom because yeah. there was oh so much piss inside of it. That it was literally so like, that was like a, a diaper, like a full it was like a, it was a diaper. Yeah. So um. So we've seen our share. Yeah. So we've seen pretty bad. But anyway, so we uh, we lifted the bed up and yes, girl storm. The frame. What? She just was like going ew about the urine oh, state. Right? The frame is infested with cockroaches. Totally. A, a pretty good colony size, too, yeah. I would say. And then we had some foragers out near the refrigerator, but We're it Stephen appears King they lives. were just foraging. They were going to come Did back. Did they do that? The Did they go? Yeah, they do. Aw. And they some... leave a path sometimes. If they go up and down a wall vertically, they go up above the suspended ceiling. They set a colony up there. They come down. You see... This so wait, one roach, substance. one roach will get food and bring it back for the other roaches. Um, no, they'll eat each other. Ugh. We found some cough it's, drops in the every ceiling. man for himself. Does anyone have a sore throat? We have found a bunch of cock of uh, cough drops. I, well, I didn't cock drops. And, and, and cockroach debris. No, I, I didn't. I didn't know if the roaches like if they foraged for other roaches. No, they don't serve each other. They serve themselves. So what about the little ones? They have to go forage for themselves as well. They learn. They start feeding. As soon as they're born. As soon as they're able to, you know, uh, molt out of uh, an egg. Yeah. Do they eat um, feces? Eat, yes, eat anything. I heard someone call. Yeah, me too. Literally, they'll, they'll, they'll eat anything. The fucking walls in this place are they'll eat literally paper thin. Paper thin. You can hear everything going on in the room next door. Roaches will eat the adhesives. They'll eat caulks. Anything that's got some kind of organic material in it, they'll eat it. You know, it's a weird fucking thing. This is so weird. The nap I took today. Yeah. During the nap, I dreamt that I ate an iPhone. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I just remembered. You ate an iPhone? Yeah, I was like, like a... no, I was I was breaking the pieces apart and eating them. And then I would take like the screen and like put it, and I'm I'm like, and it was it tasted good. It was fine. And then you woke up and go, I hate this phone. And I was eating 
an iPhone. I ate the whole thing, and I said, this should not be good because I'm going to get sick or something. Was it the iPhone 11 you were eating? It may be, because I'm really, Cause you I'm, like I'm really over the iPhone 11. You don't like the iPhone 11. 11. Dan snack of choice. I know everybody loves the iPhone 11. I'm not a big fan. But yeah, I ate the, the whole phone. And I'm like, I'm like, it's going to come out in my poop. And... This, this episode is sponsored by Asbestos. Someone we would we would check the ceiling above the bed. I just don't want to make any noise because we're gonna to have to stand on. It's hot chairs. And, yeah, yeah, it's and an it's eight high. foot ceiling. It's an eight foot ceiling. We're we're gonna make so much noise, and I don't want to. The people down below us, I don't want to disturb yeah. them. If you weren't watching, we had that man paid good money. A couple, and the woman knocked at the door, and the guys in the background. He did not have a gun. I made that. What did she look like, the woman? Just. Maybe a 30-ish looking woman. Blonde, brunette. No, she was African-American. Oh, I gotta go introduce myself. Be right back. Okay. <laughs> and so was her boyfriend. I'm gonna stay right where I am. <laughs> <laughs> and they're in the room right below us. Yeah, it sucks. I don't want to wake anybody up. So, ratings? So, ratings. Um, Who wants to start? I mean, Dan only knows one number. It's a five, right? Yeah, and my number for this room is a one. It always is a one. Because it... It's almost never not a one for Dan. What about, what, what, in that jungle-themed room, did you give that a one? A four. That, that, was, a that four. was a four. That room was cool. I gave the jungle room a four. Yeah, well, we agreed on that. <laughs> that was a pre Well, because it was fun. And also, generally, it was and clean. It generally, it was clean. There were it no had a bugs, few little things. A few little things, but nothing big. But it was just, that was such a fun episode. Yes. You guys dressed up in those Halloween costumes. Oh, and that was so good. We were so drunk. And then uh, the next day, telling Rick that, or Brennan and I played a joke on Rick and said that... Oh, uh, thank you very much, um... The, uh, Dan Law 83. Dan Law 83, thank you so much. Appreciate that. Um, yeah, but my number's a one. Who? Uh, what would? You, what would you? What number would you give this room? Are you gonna give it a two? Yeah, it's a one. Thank you. It's a one. That's a one. Yeah, it's a, it's a dump. Get, get, fix the roaches. Fix the mattress. Replace the. If shower. there were no bugs and the mattress was clean, I would give it a. It would be up like almost. Get to a some. That kind of. Get some kind of a That's bleach. what I'm saying. It would still be a two. Yeah. Get, just get bleach and mix it with some water. Say, put in maybe three ounces of bleach. Frankie T, we are not ounces. staying here now. Uh-uh. We don't stay at the dirty rooms. God. And then spray it on the wall yeah. every day for a couple of days. And that'll loosen up all that mildew and grime. And then you can just spray one more time. And wipe it all Wear a off. mask and go in and scrub it down and give it a good wipe. That can be another gauge of how it, dirty you need to do it for days. They have products now. Foaming uh, shower. The foaming stuff, stuff. I love the foaming bubble you just stuff. Put, you spray that on, leave spray it on for on, 10 let minutes. It, and then come back It'll and kill everything it. and then you just wipe it down and it's gone. You can take the shower and just rinse. Yeah. You totally could. Uh, Yoshi Kabayashi. Thank you very much. Yoshi Kabayashi. Towards the room. Keep it coming, bros. Thanks. Thank you so much, Yoshi. And um, Santa Christ, here's some beer money for all of you. Also, Cochise, have a Sega. Thank you. Thank you, Santa Thanks, Christ. That man. was very nice of you. Good old references of the simpler times. <laughs> um, all right, you guys. So we, we got through here. We got it. We did it. We, uh, I'm glad it delivered, because so, I was a little bit worried when we saw the nice bed. I was like, oh, man, and then, this is going to be a bummer. But then we, that roach colony delivered everything we needed. You had the cucarachas on the floor, and you had the stale um, eau de vagini spray going on. Jake Krause, Jake Krause asked, what, what hotel chain do I or any of you recommend? And I'm... I'm gonna. I like Hampton. Well, that's Hilton. 
I mean, All Hampton right. Inn is Hilton. All right, well, that's... I, cool. I would go, you know, honestly, um, and I, I've been saying this for a while, like, usually I stay at Hilton's. But the new Holiday Inn uh, hotels are actually really, really I Actually, nice. I'm, a, I'm a frequent whatever of the Holiday Inn. Um, the one thing I love about the Holiday Inn is their beds. Their beds are fucking... Yeah, very nice. Amazing. I think they're literally, like, some of the best beds in the industry because I have stayed in some of the nicest hotels and the beds are nowhere near as nice as no. what you get at Holiday Inn. Holiday Inn, um, it's almost like they did a study or something to figure out what know. would be the best bed... But I think that the Hampton Hiltons are close, and then like the the Comfort Inns aren't too bad. I uh, now what would be two. a good budget chain? It's like that, Comfort Inns, the lowest I'm going to go. A budget chain that is consistently nice, and that's that's difficult because it seems like these days the only way you get a decent room is if you spend over a hundred dollars. Which is really sad. I, th I guess the Choice Hotels are the chain I'm talking about that could be like maybe 80. Uh, Bailey Colarusso, love you guys. My sister and friends hooked and you made our night. Thanks for what y'all do. Thank you, Bailey and Thank friends. You. And, I stayed at this place called a Washington. And uh, Trent Helmendaller, I worry about you boys getting the hepatitis from these rooms or shot by a drug dealer. Love you guys. Thank well, you. We don't worry about I, that. Yeah, we don't worry about that. Um... True seed. Ever True consider seed doing videos at flea markets? Hmm. Wouldn't be a bad idea, but you don't know how the people are going to react. Yeah. That. You know, that's the problem. They see a camera. And they freak out, or why right. are you filming my stuff? And You know, so that's kind of why we don't Maybe do we should do, like, our own version of flea market flip. No. Okay. No. Let's do well, our own version. You look, you look a little bit like Laura. <laughs> Laura Spencer? Yeah, you'd love it. It's Lara. It's Lara. Lara, Lara, I'm sorry. Lara. No, I used to watch that show. I love that show. I still watch it. It's Carlos Martinez, Reborn, says, are you all gays? Yes. No. Yeah. <laughs> I'm the only gay person yeah, here. Actually, we're heteros and he's gay. Why do you care? Because I think Carlos... I'm... Hetero, but I'm oh, you were attracted to us all? I'm emotional. Carlos, weak. thank you very much. I appreciate the compliment. Um, Art Mava, thank you so much, darling. Oh, yeah, see, I knew you would say that. He's a, it's disgusting. He's re, He's been reborn into an asshole. Rick might be the most flamboyant. Car Carlos. Ah, look at that. Somebody just said Rick might be the most flamboyant. Carlos, Carlos has been reborn into a giant... Asshole, ban him for life, my uh, minions. My my mods, get rid of him forever. You permanently. Hey, Morpheus, I'm thinner Rick, than a if bear. If you don't stop doing that, I'm going to kill you. I don't care. I, I know. I know. I, I know. He there are that. a thousand people waiting on him, <laughs> and he's got to go back and flip anywhere he sees his name. You can watch the. Shh. Thank you very much. Ten dollars from Joe Thank Rand. You. Thank you. <laughs> can I? Can we talk? Or, <laughs> can I? I mean, do you want to like? I have yet to give my personal. I know, hotel Rick. He brand. just please, talks well, the whole fucking please, thing. Would you please uh, thank the next uh, donation? My you, favorite you hotel to stay at. I stayed at this place called Wash the Washington. That place was good. I got a free mug. Oh, Carlos had to come back with his second account. Um. So now he's, he's like, I ban you. Rick, give my mom. It's Carlos Martinez Infinity. Whew. It's funny. Bitch, please. You know you're a sucking dick. That's why you're reborn. But all the, Sonic. All those, guys, all those guys are like DL. They're all reborn and praying the. I'm not gay. Praying Chelsea. the gay away. Thank you, Chelsea. I like women. <laughs> women, 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 women. Can I help numb that? Here. Num, 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 What's that guy's name? Oh, I can't remember. Andrew Chad Caldwell. Yeah. I watch him on Facebook. I love him. 
He is the most. Man's no more. He is the most ridiculous. Do you ever watch his Facebook? I only know that one clip. Oh my god, he's fucking crazy. Uh, so, oh my god, Rick, say the Pledge of Allegiance for forty nine dollars. Potato grower. Pledge of Allegiance. I pledge allegiance to the flag right. of, the of the United States, States of America, America and to the, the republic, republic to which it stands. Even know what it is. One nation under, under God, God, indivisible, with, with liberty and justice for all. Liberty and justice. For God bless America. God, wow, they really put uh, that into my brain. Thank you so much. Uh, uh, Kat Trussier, it's my daughter's 18th birthday. Can you wish Chloe a happy birthday and give her your best advice for being a grown-up? Happy birthday, oh. Chloe. Happy birthday, happy birthday Chloe. Chloe. My and listen to your mother. And she's 18. Uh, that's a, that's best a, advice for being a grown-up. That's yes. a life-changing life um, number. First of all, you're not a grown-up. You're 18. And I would just say have fun until you're 35 and settle down. Yeah. A a 18 Do is... Do not... Listen to your mother is already way much. She's already butting in way too much. Leave her alone. Stop paying five dollars to have people talk to her. Oh, go party, again. honey. Have a good time. Don't have a listen. Time. Don't listen to Dan. Do well in college or whatever you're going Kat, to. Cat, I'm just do. kidding. Cat, I'm kidding. I feel like 18 is where you get, like, the preview to the fun, and then 21 is when, like, Hi, like, France. your life starts. Mescaline. I love mescaline. Do a slow-mo series. What? Oh, oh, bonjour. 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 Bonjour, France. Quand on fait Je m'appelle Richard. I checked the nightstands. There's nothing. Oui, let's sound the back. happy 18th, Chloe. Just, you know, just um, find your way. I know French. When I was 18, I just wanted ah. to... Ticklers. To, um... Have a good time, so. Discotheque. What Jacques was that? Cousteau. I am Jacques Cousteau. Discotheque. Baguette. Pen. 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 Du pain et like du people. beurre. It's like someone entering their window. Café au lait. Was that the, um, oh, it's probably the bacteria. I mean, I mean. Oh, check the nightstands. Oh. I already did. There's nothing in them. There's nothing in the nightstands. Boring nightstands. Sorry, folks. Are there any new Another Dirty Room releases coming, and when? Yes, there are new episodes coming up. Um, when will the next one come out? Next, this month. This month is a new release? Sometime this month. Okay. NordVPN. Will there be one next month? Yes. And will there be one after that? There'll and be one month. every month for the one next... One every month? For the next four months. For the next four months? And then I'm doing a best of Dirty Room. A best of Dirty Room. It's going to be like... Like a review. It's going to be like an Hi, hour. Hi, I saw that. I saw your message. How you doing? An hour of filthy, uh, horrible, the worst we've seen on this That's show. What I'm Thank saying. you, DJ Infinity. He said, when's the next ghost hunt or creeps and monsters? Creeps I'm and Monsters. Sure I'm hoping Creeps and Monsters this month. I, I Maybe. I'm ready. Meanwhile, everyone go check out Devil's Well Part 2. Actually, check out Rick Sarah's channel. Rick Sarah on YouTube would be we need, uh, a good thing to try out. Yeah, we need... Um, Cochise looks like he smells like a UTI. Oh, my God. Oh, no! Did somebody really say that? Where's my hat? Give me my Jesus hat. Jesus Christ. <laughs> All right, guys. Come on. Oh, my God. Your show should be on A&E. Damn. What he said. That was brutal. Ouch. Welfare Bob Ross smells like a UT. Oh, there's Rick's channel. Destiny Glenn just put it in. So Somebody you guys, just put a link in the chat room. You guys, check your channel and see how many people have signed on. Okay, let's We're trying to get look. Rick to 4,000 watch hours so he can... Is it the beard? Should I shave? He can... Uh, are you I still... Should, I should shave. You're still upset about that? People, I, 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 I gotta change the way I look. Oh, my God. <laughs> All right, so I have 6,400 views on the Another Dirty Room Buffalo documentary. It must be good because 6,400 people have already viewed it. Why don't you try it out? How many, uh...
Ooh, you have nearly 800 likes on it and only two dislikes. 800 likes and two money. dislikes, that's a good percentage. That's very good. I'd say it's 98%. Uh, Liz W., my dad used to grade restaurants, hotels for a living. I told him about you guys, and he thinks you're all wild. Come to North Carolina. We have a lot of filthy rooms. Love you, Rick. Oh, that's tremendous. Liz thank W., you. thank you, darling. And again, thank you to Potato Grower. I thought that was a lot of fun. And, uh, and yeah, so... Uh, so... <clears throat> I guess we're done. I guess we're done. That's Shopping it. with Rick was funny, you thought? Thank you very much. We just did the new one. That's over on Dan's channel. And check out my cartoons at Curly Cheddar on Instagram. Nay Fox says, if you change the way you look, she'll never talk to you again. She doesn't talk to me now. What? The, what who, who are these people that supposedly talk to me? If you go to well, Coach's Instagram. I want you to appreciate his art on Instagram at Curly Cheddar. I'm banned from Twitter right now, but on Twitter... What I'm... did you get banned for? <laughs> so on the Boston Market Twitter, they made a tweet of something like, uh, what's something you can say to a rotisserie chicken that you can't say to your girlfriend? And me and like 1,100 other people... What'd you say? ...commented, what if my chicken is my girlfriend? And all uploaded the same picture of a guy with his dick and a raw chicken. <laughs> oh, no! Oh, shut up. <laughs> And it took him like four days to find that I got banned for a week. <laughs> Eleven 1, hundred people joined you. There's still a bunch of comments with that picture on there. They haven't caught all of them yet. I like how Rick just like screams. <laughs> I cannot help myself. If it's funny, I just I break open. These coaches have to register yeah. with the town. <laughs> what? All right, you guys, uh, it has been fabulous. It is now after 2 a.m. I want to go home. Um, so that if it's 2 a.m., I'm probably not going to do an after party. This has all been a party. Another time I'll do a, a live you can do a You can do a short one. A short, a short one. one. Go over to Rick's channel. He'll go live right now. Just go live on your channel now. Well, I need to have uh, a we'll get, my hotspot, so let me hook up to mine. We'll get people to... Uh, sign on here but thank you all so much for this evening it was fun give us a like on this video we're at 800 now we need a thousand or i'm gonna kill myself please hurry <laughs> if he kills himself there goes my meal ticket all right i know i'm not on the internet you dumb piece of shit don't talk to Siri like that. Jesus, you misogynist. Didn't you watch the football halftime show? Siri is a sweet woman, and you're talking to her like she's trash. Well. <laughs> um, we may do another one of these next weekend. We're running out of motels. <laughs> We're going to have to... Cross state, like what you know, what we should do ADR Washington DC. Ooh, we've never done that. Why haven't we done that yet? Washington so DC, yeah, or ADR Philly. Where's that? We did ADR Philly. Oh, you and I went out, remember? <laughs> oh, yeah, I just remember eating really good cheesesteak. Remember that horrible hotel you had to walk, walk up all the stairs because they didn't have five an elevator? Of stairs. We had to walk up five flights of stairs to the fifth floor because the elevators didn't work. Yeah, I forgot that was in Philly. I mean, what a joke. Well. Okay, Rick is now. What? Does this say I want to FaceTime you? Yeah. What the hell? That... I know, that's weird. So, Rick, I will tell you when he's live. Let's see if I can even do it. This has been Dan Bell, Crusty Harry UTI. And the illustrious... No, you're not a crusty hair. You just look like you smell like a UTI. That's a different... Right. Yeah. It's because I spent you, so much You time don't actually pubes. look like a UTI. You just smell like one. I don't know. My hair could be the pubes, my face, the infection. <laughs> All right, Rick is signing on 
if any of our mods here want to be a mod on Rick's channel, um, <laughs> go ahead and send him a little request. All right, now Rick is live. So go to Rick's so channel. We're over here live at Rick's channel on YouTube. AC Castillo, Hello, yes, and thank you. Oh, this is... I'm going to go live now. Just give me a second. All right, y'all. Go over to Rick's channel right now. Uh, Destiny Glenn, if you could put in Rick's um, uh, thing again. Can she, like, pin it? Like, sticky it? No, I don't think you can pin it, but you can just put it in. And uh, we'll get over onto Rick's channel. I can see we're all... There's people coming on there now. So we're going to head over to Rick's. Thank you all very much for being here uh -oh, tonight. This was another Dirty Room Live again. Love you guys so much. Thank you so much. We'll see you over on Rick's channel. And uh, have a wonderful night. See you, Nara. Rick, why don't you say goodbye to the fans here? Goodbye. It and was really a pleasure being with you. Jump over and join Hi, on to Rick's thing. It's a pleasure thing. being with you. <laughs> Give us a like. It's 878. I'm going to kill myself. I love you. A thousand people. Come on over. Stop saying you're going to kill yourself, Dan. <laughs> <laughs> I got 75 of you on. Thank you for coming over and joining our party in progress. It's buffering for you. I'm sorry that is the case. All right, guys. Have a good night. Bye. Sex goddess.